Hey guys, you're looking this is Kyle Reddish, and I'm here with Tommy Lamont. Yeah. And Baton Rouge, Louisiana. You just got second place at the KMC here. Uh, uh, unfortunately, so you lost to that man over there with his silly, silly okay, queens. Okay, okay, but we'll get to his deck later. So let's do your deck profile. How many cards is this? Forty cards. Now this seems very similar to CLG build, Cyberlord Games. I don't know. Yeah, I've been talking to Joe Bass. I've been on Facebook. No, it's okay. Getting his input on the deck. I've arrived at a little before. Absolutely. Uh, let's go over card for card. Free mesmerize. Right, you, um, it's like gonna know all of the I I played this deck at uh, Winter Champs actually and got top four in an LCQ. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, this is one of the cards that's new to it, and it lets you just play the control matchup against take aggressive decks a lot. Uh, it's just really solid and definitely includes me in the deck. Absolutely. Uh, Sigurdal with Bloom Hollow. Uh, this adorable is, gaze. Yeah, definitely got you to the finals in my opinion. Yeah, he's he's real he's real solid. Uh, I knew that, or I figured there's gonna be like a lot of rushy decks. <laughs> uh, no, like Bobby played rush. Uh, you didn't play rush. I played the most. Uh, there was a, uh, and then it also helps in the the green white blue uh, tempo deck. He just blocks forever. Um, and I played three. Because you know, it's, you know, it's gotta play three, two more. Good against bugs, stuff like that. Yeah, he's really good. Uh, tear Pit, standard removal for you. Yeah, uh, it's a three kills in Furnaces. It does kill, it kills in Furnace and Pot, uh, Pink Limb. Until uh, he gets another. So. <laughs> um, two, Screech Scare Double? Well, I only had two signed ones, so I had to play him. Really? Nice. Uh, but, uh, no, I think it's like super solid. It removes Scamped, it removes uh, this guy, which helps me play a lot. Okay. Swing a lot more? Yes! It removes Aqua Strider and Grudge Weaver, which is pretty solid. Two Bone Blades? Two Bone Blades. Um, yeah, I, would, I guess I would have liked to play the third, but I think I've got enough like yeah. answers to small dudes between um, this and this. Probably didn't need a third. I know a lot of lists cut it to two simply to get it to 40 cards, yeah. and they don't want to give uh, a keeper trigger yeah, to their awesome. opponent. So. Uh, two of this guy. I'll take you out if you uh, keep He's like the best card in the game. Yeah, uh, I see that. We're like top three. Yeah. Um, Personally, I think Finbar is the best. Yeah, he's top three with uh, these guys. I agree. Uh, uh, gets, gets a little crazier after rotation. Yeah. <laughs> he's a he's real good. Uh, I actually won my last round of or second last round of Swiss off of a, a double Swiss. So one I'm followed by the other. But one followed by yeah. the other. Yeah. I, I do like four cards that time, but still. Uh, <laughs> Finbar is Finbar's real good too. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Uh Cyber Scam. Cyber Scam, well, you saw him in the finals. If he doesn't hit Kendra Grasp, uh, he's pretty solid. He helps you uh, rush he's out sold. decks. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, just like he's he's really good too. A lot of these cards are good. Uh, General Finbar. <laughs> He's, he's a, another he's another contender for best card. Yeah. Um, just insane tempo, insane card draw. Allows you to attack times when you should just hold back a little bit and he's you don't right. get punished too hard he's for it. He's pretty insane. Yeah, I agree. Uh, one Rasalka, a miser? Uh, yes. I didn't know you had one. Yeah. Oh, uh, just this was this was gonna be a thing. Like this is gonna become that. But it was just one of the cards that like I had to cut. Mm -hmm. Um. I had two, one, yeah, two one outers in the deck, and it's yeah. Rusalka and Lotus Hand. He gives a really solid effect, but I don't always like to see it. I agree. Um, I know Joe's a big fan of this card. Lotus Hand, so good. It's just like three two cards. Oh yeah. Uh, Let's do it. Yeah, and it, it's I don't want to play more than one. But I it feels play like one. It's worth playing. You got uh, three of this guy. Oh, uh, you Michael need it for the rush matchup. I'm taking it straight off. off. He takes up multi sim slots. Is the only problem with him. So many but, cards. Yeah. I see no minor beetle prime, but I'm sure some of your opponents are playing around that. Well, actually, I'm thinking uh, that you might have a oh, miser okay. or two I of it. I guess. I guess it's possible. Yeah. I mean, I only play three enforcers. Yeah. yeah. These guys aren't enforcers. Yeah. yeah. Like, if these guys were enforcers, I think I think the deck would be better with minor prime. But that's what I did. Two PJs. Three PJs. Also premium. Like I did the same thing. I took it. The only thing bad about it. Multi yeah, it's ridiculous. Like Amazing turn one to go to turn two, cyber scam, stuff you like that. Yeah. Uh, so we got three keeper of laws. What does this guy do? Is he good for you? He's, uh, he's pretty good. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> spell proof, draws cards. Well, it's fun. pretty essential. <laughs> uh, Liber the blazing sun. He's like he's like the second best six drop to uh, to General Finbar. Yep. Just also a liar. He locks down either threats. He can trade with Binder Beetle, which happens a lot. 
you lock down your opponent, you reload, they can't tap you. You just swing a lot you and draw a card because you obviously paid for him. Okay. Uh, two Andrew? Um, I mean... Not three, keep it trimmed to 40. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, I wouldn't play three. I'd, I'd probably play the third this dude over this guy. Yeah. But, uh, usually the first one goes into mana, and then you play the second one. Yeah. And he's uh, good turn out. Yeah. Three of these guys? I mean... Boss of Trolls? They're just excellent, clearly. It gets around uh, Infernus' Decree? It, yeah, it gets around a lot of stuff. Uh, it's bigger than... Like all the cards in your deck, except the big guys. It gets around, yeah, it gets around Infernus, it gets around Herald, it gets around like a bunch of guys. Uh, one thing I don't have in here is Neptus. Yeah. And that's something that like the CLG guys are big on, and oh, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I have an excuse for that one. Like this could have been a Neptus, this could have been a Neptus. Like. Here's the thing, you don't need an excuse. Right. Because this, this 40 card build that, that you tweaked got you to second place. Um, you said there's about a 90% chance you're going to go to Seattle. Yeah. I would love to see that at 100. What? So, uh, <laughs> congratulations. Right, thank uh, you. On top of all the prizes that you got, you won. Did you win your sim? I'm yeah, sorry. I got yeah. a red, a red bean. Nice. Yeah. Nice. And you, and you run the, the fire mat, yeah. but you don't you don't play fire. <laughs> Just one of those things. <laughs> it's all good. I got the green, blue deck box off. My sim is light. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, congratulations, and uh, you guys will be able to get to, to get to see this guy in, in Seattle. So, uh, glad you played it. Nice deck. We'll see you then. Right, Have a great you. one. Peach.